to do when you're out here alone But listen to the radio till daylight breaks Hoping they play something that'll keep you awake The whole night trucker station came Good day, good day ladies and gentlemen This is the trucker Rudy coming to you this fine morning Yeah, well, or whatever it is to you, you fine day, here. fine Take morning the to the right on yep. east. We have just gotten our load it's like 2.30 in the afternoon already, but uh, hey, we got our load. That's all that matters, right? And now it's uh, <laughs> spraying all kinds of dirt on my windshield there when vehicles pass me and all that stuff. So we got to try and keep our windshield clean so you guys can see out of the window. But uh, yeah, we have gotten in our radio. Take the entrance to the right on No, we got to hammer down hammer down we can't really waste too much time right now good thing I had me breakfast there at the husky before I uh, before I decided to take off to my customer and all that good stuff so we are all set ready to go well, we got a long ways to go we got like 12 and a half hours of driving probably well, at least 12 probably so uh, well, it's probably going to be a late night for us, but uh, I'm going to try and make it all the way to Brandon tonight, so that way we're ready to go. We'll be ready at the customer there for the morning. Well, won't be morning when we get unloaded, but uh, we're supposed to get unloaded there by 12. Our appointment is for 12, so we'll... Uh, We'll try and make sure that we can get there before 12. Yes, indeed. That's the goal for right now, anyways. I just hope we don't get too much snow out further uh, east. I know they're expecting snow up here all weekend, I think. I think the lady was saying till Monday there in the restaurant. But, hey got to deal with it I guess we do now have a heater unit like a heater to heated trailer to keep the product uh, at a you know around te uh, room temperature so that way it doesn't freeze it's supposed to keep it at 50 Fahrenheit so it's above freezing point that's for sure but yeah so let's get uh, get out of town here and Let's get some miles behind us. We'll do probably pretty good miles today. That's, that's probably closer to 700 miles that we're going to do today. And I probably won't get there before 3 o'clock in the morning or something like that. But hey, we slept in pretty good today, so should be able to do that. I mean, if I do get tired, I will pull over. I'm not afraid to do that. I am always for safety, so if I do get tired, I'm just gonna pull her over and call her quits. We'll continue on tomorrow, but I think we'll be all right. I think we will be. So uh, yeah, appreciate you guys tuning in. That's coming right along for the rest of the day. It looks like the sun is starting to go down and down and down, yeah. In winter time the sun goes down so early and gets up so late that you really have to work at it <laughs> try and put the video together you know like that's just the way it is in summer you got way more hours many more hours to uh, to shoot a video you know and in winter time they only give you a few hours of daylight and then you gotta have your video done by then otherwise <laughs> It's going to be shot in the dark. <laughs> yeah, that's the way it is, I guess. But, uh, hey, we're making good time. We got a little over 200 kilometers behind us already. So, so yeah, looks like pretty soon it's going to be dark. And then we'll be uh, driving in the dark, as they say. I already did make me a little bit of a pit stop there a little bit ago. And cleaned my headlights up a little bit because the road was really wet there in Calgary so 
got a lot of slush and stuff like that onto the headlights so they were really dirty so I figured I do that just before it gets dark so that way uh, that way we got clean headlights and uh, we can see what's going on on the road right it's all about safety so yeah looks like we got uh, well 86 kilometers to uh, Madison had it looks like so yeah we got some ways to go yet I might make me a pit stop there in Madison hat go inside grab me a bite to eat there and then continue on with my journey but we'll see what we'll do I know they got an AMW there at the uh, I think it's a Coop that they got up there Coop or no I think it's Petropass Petropass that's what it is so we'll see uh, We'll see if we can go in there, maybe and grab us a quick bite to eat and then uh, get out of there, you know. But yeah, it looks like we're gonna, gonna be driving late, late, late night, that's for sure. But Oh well, that's the uh, life of a trucker, eh? You can't always choose your hours the way you would like to. And, I mean, you know, I could stop early and just take my break and then go down there, but then I would have to get up super early in the morning and I mean depending on what time I go to bed too right I could also just drive till midnight or something like that and in Canada we're only required to have eight hours off so I could just go have my eight hours off and then uh, you know I could be uh, getting out of there by quarter after eight so you know that's a possibility but We'll see what we will do, depending on how I feel. I mean, if I only, you know, got another three hours to go by midnight, then may as well just continue, right? That's the way I look at it. But, yeah. We'll see what happens. Well, guys, it has been a long day for me. We got here to Brandon at uh, 3 a.m. in the morning, and we went straight to bed, and... Uh, now we are done unloading and actually went over here to the Husky Husky truck stop you might be able to see that right there and uh, took us a shower and had some good breakfast much needed breakfast now we're all full and actually ready to start our new day so I figured well I know yesterday wasn't much of a day but uh, hey better than uh, nothing uh, you know better than nothing right so uh, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. I will start a new day and uh, we'll uh, see what kind of goodies we can show you the next day. So don't go nowhere and we'll be back tomorrow. So appreciate you guys watching. This has been Trucker Rudy signing out. behind me that day is gonna come